The cosmos, but these black holes discovered just a few weeks ago, are so massive that we believe that they are actually remnants of quasar. Music, exploring the inter and the discoveries, brought to light by James Webb's cutting-edge technology and the work of scientists. So let's start with the basics shall we, introduction to black holes. Black holes are cosmic entities known for their immense gravitational pull, drawing vast amounts of matter into an incredibly compact space, creating what is often called a gravity well. This gravitational force is so overwhelming that even light cannot escape its clutches, making black holes appear as dark voids in the fabric of the universe throughout the cosmos. Smaller black holes are scattered, typically formed as the remnants of massive dying stars. In contrast, supermassive black holes boasting astronomical masses ranging from a million to a billion times that of our Sun dominate the cores of nearly all large galaxies. Despite decades of research, the origins of supermassive black holes remain a mystery to us. Even now, researchers are still grappling with understanding how these entities come into existence and how they manage to achieve their mind-boggling masses. The process that drives their formation continues to elude scientists, leaving them captivated by these giants that govern the hearts of galaxies across the cosmos. The recent discovery, but mankind is slowly uncovering more and more of the truth. In Sagittarius, there is a black hole weighing 2 to 4 million times the mass of our sun, and we on Earth are actually moving around that black hole. A giant black hole, measuring approximately 9 million times the mass of the sun, has been discovered, and scientists couldn't be happier. The remarkable finding was made possible by the cutting-edge James Webb Space Telescope, which detected the presence of this massive entity nestled at the core of a galaxy a mere 570 million years after the event known as the Big Bang. The importance of this discovery goes beyond its sheer size, as it opens the door to a deeper understanding of the origins of these cosmic giants. As more such discoveries are expected to surface in the near future, scientists hold hope that the mystery surrounding the early emergence of these behemoths in cosmic history may eventually be unraveled. After all, many discoveries have been made over the decades already. Scientists have identified two distinct types of black holes, stellar-mass black holes and supermassive black holes. Stellar-mass black holes, typically ranging from 5 to 10 times the mass of our Sun, are believed to be born from the cataclysmic deaths of massive stars. When these stars exhaust their nuclear fuel, they undergo a gravitational collapse, ending in a supernova explosion. In the aftermath, what remains is a stellar mass black hole, a gravitational remnant that marks the end of a once giant star's life. On a grander scale, supermassive black holes take center stage in the course of most, if not all, large galaxies. These cosmic behemoths are a stunning million to billion times the mass of our Sun, defying our current knowledge and understanding with their size and massive gravitational pull. While their origins remain a subject of ongoing research and fascination, their existence is no doubt a testament to the forces that shape the universe. You know how we usually think that supermassive black holes form by just eating and eating until they become gigantic? Well, turns out it's not that simple. Astronomers like Stephen Finkelstein from the University of Texas at Austin have detected these humongous black holes more than a billion times the mass of our Sun appearing less than a billion years after the Big Bang. It's mind-boggling how they could grow so massive in such a short time. To crack this puzzle, scientists are looking into the distant past of the universe, about 13.7 billion years ago. But you know what? It's not easy. The light from that far back has traveled a long way, and dust can get in the way, making these early black holes extremely faint and hard to study. It's like trying to solve a mystery with only bits and pieces of the puzzle. But maybe that's the thrill of astronomy, exploring the unknown and uncovering secrets one step at a time. So, we've stumbled upon the biggest find. Astronomers have discovered a brand new black hole nestled in a galaxy called Sears 1019. The exciting discovery came to light during the Cosmic Evolution Early Release Science Survey, a deep exploration of galaxies. At its core, this initiative represents an endeavor crafted to not only test, but also confirm the methodologies used in the research. This ambitious project is strategically positioned within the well-known constellations of Ursa Major and Boots. There's a lot of data gathered through the survey, 
and it has set the astronomical community abuzz. And it makes sense why. The information gathered through JWST's perceptive lens holds the potential to unravel unexplored elements of cosmic evolution. These insights serve as electromagnetic signatures, similar to fingerprints, revealing the chemical composition, mass, and many other essential properties that define this unique galaxy. Through this analysis, scientists hold the power to reshape our understanding of celestial processes. Finding more about the universe's history What's even more fascinating is that this gem isn't alone. In fact, they found two other old, supermassive, black holes. How did the discovery take place? And it's all thanks to the extensive Sears survey that astronomers have made significant strides in their quest for knowledge. By combining near- and mid-infrared images from the Space Telescope with detailed spectral data, they've unlocked recent discoveries of black holes in galaxies like Sears 1019. The telescope's remarkable capabilities are taking astronomy research from the realm of theory to measurable reality. And with its powerful technology, we're now able to observe and study these phenomena in unprecedented detail. What we know now is that as light embarks on its journey from distant galaxies to reach Earth, it undergoes a transformation. Slowly, it becomes distorted, stretched into longer wavelengths, and transitions toward the infrared part of the spectrum. How did these keen astronomers spot the black hole residing in Sears, 1019? Well, they hunted for radiant galactic cores known as active galactic nuclei believed to be the grand unveiling of black holes that greedily devour matter, releasing immense energy in the process. For a long time, scientists believed early black holes were rare occurrences. Yet, to their surprise, the JWST's first-year observations revealed a treasure trove of active black holes existing within the first billion years of our universe's existence. Armed with the remarkable capabilities of the JWST's highly sensitive infrared instruments, the CER survey has proved invaluable. What makes these black holes so special? According to an exciting NASA press release, Sears 1019 stands out not only for its ancient existence, but also for its surprisingly little weight. This captivating black hole tips the scales at around 10 million solar masses, a far cry from the massive distant black holes detected by other telescopes. These giants exceed 1 billion times the mass of the sun and emit much brighter signals. All this makes them easier to spot. For context, let's compare the black hole reigning at the heart of our very own Milky Way galaxy, famously known as Sagittarius A**, which measures about 4.3 million times the mass of our sun. While this might sound immense, don't be fooled, it's relatively lighter for a contemporary supermassive black hole. Also, this new find doesn't shine as brightly as the previously detected more. Massive black holes, hence making it harder to spot. The team's findings, the largest black hole ever observed. Sears, 1019 is approximately three times the size of the previous record holder, TON618, known for its massive 66 billion solar masses. This groundbreaking discovery adds a unique twist to the narrative surrounding early black hole formation. Not only does Sears 1019 possess a smaller mass, but its existence also offers a glimpse into the diversity that may characterize the early universe. By investigating these smaller, more commonplace black holes, scientists aim to piece together a comprehensive understanding of the cosmic ballet that unfolded during the universe's infancy. These findings add depth to the storyline of the universe's evolution, highlighting the potential presence of a diverse array of black holes that once populated the ancient cosmos. The early detection of these black holes presents a golden opportunity for astronomers to explore the conditions and mechanisms that facilitated their formation during the early epochs of the universe. With the JWST's unmatched capabilities, the door is open to countless possibilities for exploration and discovery. As we continue to delve into the mysteries of the cosmos, the James Webb Space Telescope stands poised to unlock even more secrets pushing the boundaries of our understanding and reshaping the way we perceive the vast expanse of space and time. It's a thrilling journey of cosmic exploration, and with each revelation, we come one step closer to unraveling the enigmatic tapestry of the universe.